Keep a lookout for the girl. We have to stop her. Pretty sure she'll be back real soon. This may sound crazy, but what if saving our doubles from execution is how we save ourselves? I was only hunted after my double was killed. Fireflies. That's what's causing the glow. Looks kind of beautiful, don't you think? Kind of weird looking. <gasps> no, this cannot be. My own eyes deceive me. My apologies for the lateness of the hour, but I must speak with you. What ails you, my friend? It is Mary. I am troubled by her, by the part she has played in these trials. Those trials trouble us all. There is more to this. I saw her smile as her own sister was executed. She took pleasure from it. Are you certain? I am. But now that she speaks of guilt and remorse, it is hard not to believe her. Keep away from her, Abraham. No good can come from being with that child. Too late. With her brother and sister gone, Mary now lives under my roof. Your charity places you in grave danger. What do you advise? Tell the court you suspect she toys with us all, that you saw her delight in her own sister's death. I implore you. I am torn. Mary seems full of Keep remorse. Your suspicions to yourself, and it's our community which will suffer. None of us is safe from her wild imaginings. Very well. If the court will listen, I will speak. I am bewitched. You're not bewitched. How else can your presence be explained? I, I can't explain this, but you're not. She has conjured you to defend her. To press me into silence. Only the devil could create a demon who so resembles me. I'm not a demon, but we do look alike, which I agree is pretty damn weird. What do you want from me? I want to know what you're going to say to the court about Mary. I was decided to speak to the court. Now I am not so sure. I know how this must look, but you have to speak out. Tell everyone what the girl did, like your friend is telling you to. The devil has sent you to tempt me. I must not succumb. Little Hope is no longer the town I knew. Strange and disturbing events have become commonplace. You, whatever you are, are but one of these. Revealing the truth about Mary may save my friend, but it does not sit easily with me that in doing so I condemn a child. Putting it all on a kid isn't right. The priest is the one driving this whole thing. That's way off. We gotta stop the kid. No other way to do this. Reverend Carver is a man guided by God. No one can doubt that. Bad move there, man. Standing up for the kid is probably gonna do us all in. I hope you're wrong, for all our sakes. What happened? You get a chance to confront Mary? No, we never even saw her. Fuck. You met up with Andrew's double, Abraham. He was thinking about testifying against Mary, but good boy Andrew talked him out of it. That was a smart move. Are you fucking kidding me? We are seeing glimpses of what happened here hundreds How of years ago. How you doing? Not great. Demons from the past? Don't know how much more of this shit I can take. One thing That's I great. didn't see coming, well, I feel like one of the team. Have makes no sense. I'm good with that. At all. N never happens to me. Yeah, I hear that. Learned a few things about myself tonight. Shame it had to be from witches and 
ghosts. This is some serious shit we're in here. Sure, I know. I get how serious this is. I just... I just want us to push through this. And we will. Thanks. Just so... wired right now. We need to get moving. Fuck this place and this stupid ass crash that got us here. Dear. Uh. Hold on to me. Whatever happens, do not let go. I'm not letting go! Gotta move, okay? What the fuck is that thing? Let's check that out. It'll get us out of these damn woods, and we can talk on the way. back there with that thing. No idea. It was a real shitstorm. What do you think? Seems like it wanted to haul my ass off into the woods. Can't even think about what might have happened to me. Is the tide beginning to turn in our favor? Whatever we saw back there or thought we saw, we're still in grave danger. There's got to be a way of stopping the girl. We might have already missed a chance to change things. You had a chance to get Mary exposed for what she is, a liar and a faker. Put her in the dock for a change. Why didn't you take it? We don't know for sure that stopping Mary will help us out. It's just a theory. It may only be a theory, but right now it's all we've got. This is a one-shot deal. We get it wrong and there's no replay. It's game over, so I'm up for doing whatever it takes. Come on, let's take a look.
Check this out. That guy's a menace. I don't think he gets how bad a mess we're in. Come on, inside. Well, no one's been here for a long time. <laughs> It's my time to speak before the judge. I am filled with dread. I cannot know how my testimony will be received. The devil has blinded so many to what is real and what is not. Nothing good will come of this. His words will seek to twist the truth. Allow me to judge what is true. Abraham and Joseph are allies in this deception. And lest we forget, you condemned Joseph to death only yesterday. Or do you now question that decision? I have heard nothing today to sway my conviction. Joseph consorted with the same malicious force as his wife. For this, the court thanks Reverend Carver, who faced the devil's wrath to present the evidence. It is only my duty, Judge. Uh, however, this court is duty bound by law to seek out the truth. We must therefore examine these claims made by Abraham against Mary. If I may speak briefly, Judge Wyman. Time is short, Reverend. Be indeed brief. Mary has shown great fortitude to speak out against the evil here. Many would have lacked her courage. Yet her reward for exposing this brooding covered in our midst is to be besmirched. Her courage is not in question. It is her intent we must be certain of. Her accuser is the very man entrusted to care for this innocent child. Plain to see he is not fit for such a task. And I would ask the court to have Mary placed elsewhere. Who would you have be her new ward, Reverend? I am prepared to take responsibility for the child, if the court agrees. First, the court must hear what Abraham has to say. No decision can be made on the child until then. Abraham! What am I to do? Some would have me speak out against Mary, but could a child truly be capable of such evil? Are you for real? The kid is guilty as hell. Just, you must do what you believe is right. Tell the court what you have come here to say. Speak up, boy. Out with it! Mary has spoken of evil spirits, devilry and witchcraft. Things many cannot believe could exist here in I'm Little Hall. I'm not here for history and hearsay. Get to the point, boy. Mary is tormented. The apparitions she has seen, they have plagued her. Stolen her innocence. Some suggest she is in league with these creatures, but no one can be certain. Myself least of all. Can any of us truly know a child's mind? You claim I lack the ability to see the truth. I beg forgiveness. I would never suggest such a thing. My time is not for wasting. You and the priest have irked me enough for one day. I have more to say. I have already given you enough time. Furthermore, Mary is to be placed into the care of Reverend Carver. Now stand down. Tell me everything. Did you see Andrew's double again? He told the judge that Mary did nothing wrong, like she's the victim here. Oh, that's bad. Very, very bad. Shit! So what happens now? This helps us. Has to. We now know for sure that we can alter what happens. What do you think? Is he right about this? Maybe I'm being dumb, but I don't get how we, or anyone, can change something that happened hundreds of years ago. Normally, I'd agree with you, but we can see these events. 
somehow they're running parallel to us, so I think we can change them. What the fuck? We can't stay. Let's get out of here. You hear that? Right below us. We need to find a way out of here, now. That's heavy. Andrew, get your ass over here and help me out. What's up? You take that side, I'll take this side. Push together, right? Good. Now, push! Whoa! Oh, shit! Ah! to get out of here! Come on! Almost made it! Let's go before anything else happens. Daniel? Where the fuck are you? Answer me! That thing looks to have gone, but it could come back any time. We have to keep moving.
Professor? Professor? Hey! You guys! Andrew? Daniel? Oh, thank God. We didn't think we'd see you again. Got lucky, I guess. First time tonight. God, I thought I'd lost you. <sighs> this isn't over. The thing back there is still after me. You see that? Stay on your toes. Anything could happen. No one in Little Hope is safe while you still draw breath, Joseph. You must die today. Not even your wife Amy was spared your lust to serve Satan. Damn me if you must. You're not fit. Speaking of my late wife. There is still fight in you. I must drive the devil out for the safety of everyone here. Oh, no one is safe. Joseph, do you renounce the devil and all his teachings? I carry no sin. I'm no disciple of the devil. I'll tell us infect you with madness. Roy, you but sins, servants, barely. We have to stop this. Get away! You give me that! Look! See how this poor child is tormented. Joseph still clutches her with the devil's hand. More stones. The devil must be crushed from within him. Do not flinch. The fate of little Orp rests in your hands. What happened? Tell me. We don't have a lot of time. Time for what? John! What are you doing? I'm tired of running. Are you crazy? We gotta move! I'm not waiting around to watch you get yourself killed! This is suicide! Angela! Come on, you fuck! I'm ready!
you fucker! Is it gone? I don't see it anymore. to figure a way out of here before that thing finds a way in. Place looks like it burned down. Something here isn't right. Something isn't right is this shitty town's motto. Gotta be the girl. Let's go find her. <laughs> She's in here. What the hell? Stay here. Andrew, what's going on? He knows I was about to confess all to the judge. No, wait. Will you protect me? You must. Wait, this isn't right. No way. I assure all gathered here today that our town will be free of the devil's grasp. Together, by God's grace, little hope will prevail. My word on it. This court is hastily convened, but with good reason. If we are to finally rid ourselves of the evil which has infested Little Hope, then we must act today. I accuse you, Mary, of witchcraft. What say you, Reverend? The evidence, as discovered through my investigation, is beyond question. Mary uses her puppet as a familiar to summon and serve the devil. We have been deceived by a child, by her guise of innocence. This puppet was mistakenly used to denounce Tabitha, but it has always belonged to Mary and Mary alone. She allowed her own kin to be executed as she watched in silence. That is not so. Liar! Now this tainted child, this creature of Satan, has the marrow to accuse me, a man of God, of wrongdoing. This is crazy. 
These people have lost their freaking minds. It was never my intention to bring harm to this town or its people. Can you help me? What can I do? If I could do something to stop this, I would, but now in her hour of greatest need, I don't this see child how. of the damned pleads once more for the Wait. devil's help. I beg the court's indulgence. Please guide me at this time. This I seek your counsel. No question there is something very wrong here. Right in the heart of this place. There can be no doubt that little hope is afflicted. That darkness has taken hold of our town. There is not a man or woman here today who does not already know the devil is in our midst. The sole purpose of this court is to remove evil, not indulge it further. Our time is not for wasting. You got this all twisted. Mary isn't to blame. How do I make my decision? I am wrong. I condemn an innocent to die. The only way I can see out of this is to get rid of that damn doll. Destroy that and... The puppet must be cast asunder. Maybe this all goes away. It is the cause of Mary's affliction. It holds her in its thrall. Destroy this puppet and the devil will depart Mary. She will be restored, an innocent child. Reverend, burn the puppet. Destroy it. We must not act in haste. The girl must face the full consequences of My her deeds. My authority is not for questioning. Do as I ask. You did everything you could. Don't blame yourself. None of this is your fault. That's it, right? I figured that if the doll, and then that would be the end of it. You made the right call. No way you could have seen what was gonna happen. That accident is not on you. Whatever questions we still got, they won't be answered now. Let's just get out of here. You okay? What just happened? I think we've seen the last of that kid.
I thought I might find you here. <laughs> well, been through the trenches, huh? Both of us been through some real tough time these past years. Nothing but ghosts left here now. Free piece of advice. You stay out of that place. This is what you had. Believe me, I know what I'm talking about. About 10 minutes down the road, there's a diner and got a working phone in it. Don't come back. Ain't nothing here for you no more. all traffic through Little Hope. You okay, buddy? You seem a little confused. Yeah, I'm fine. I just want to get these folks to where they need to be. I doubt a short delay will trouble them too much. Can everyone just shut up? This isn't helping us find help or getting us out of here. Hi there. How you doing? Excuse me, but we're uh, looking for our bus driver. What? Have you seen him? Yeah, that's funny. Sounds like you could use a drink. Better not, thanks. I need to keep a clear head. What's going on in there? Get the hell out of here. I'll go once I look you in the eye. Now let me in. Hey! I don't think he gets how bad a mess we're in. That's it. Game over. You're done. For now, at least. You could always try again, see if you can get a different result. That's the problem with demons. 
If you don't lay them to rest, they will haunt you forever. Not a very happy ending. Or maybe it is. Depends on what makes you happy, really. And you eventually found him. The bus driver. Maybe he can now put the past behind him. Until we meet again, maybe in the Arabian desert, maybe somewhere else. But we will meet again, at least one more time.